As the sun began to rise over the horizon, illuminating to the rolling hills of Kampala, runners laced up their shoes, pinned on their rest bibs, and prepared themselves for the challenge ahead. Among them were elite athletes, their determination evident in the focused glint, in their eyes alongside passionate advocates, and every day, individuals eager to make a difference in their community. The Absa Kampala Hills Run holds a special place in the hearts of many, not only of its challenging course, but also for its profound mission. I, have, I was been training things for a long time, and my ambition is training is the good thing. Since its inception, the run has been more than just a sporting event. It has been a platform for the social change. Proceeds from the run dedicated to supporting the education of young girls, empowering them with the tools they need to succeed in life. Uh, today we've held the second edition of the Absa Cage 37 Hills Run and the run is aimed at uh, promoting girl child education. There are so many challenges that the girl child faces, especially as they finish primary and go into secondary education. The school dropout rates are very high when they get to that level, so we want to be able to help keep the girl child in school by supporting and working with different NGOs to provide menstrual hygiene care, uh, provide school fees uh, to educate the girls from uh, senior one to senior four. In Uganda, like many parts of the world, socio-economic barriers often stands in the way of girls' access to education, depriving them of the opportunities and resources they need to thrive. But with every step taken, runners were not just racing towards the finishing line, they were racing towards a brighter future for the next generation of girls. Gabo Amon, Moses, reporting for UBS TV. To help give the award. Thank you very much.